Hey guys, what's going on? Megan here on my way to work. Gonna leave you guys off with a quick um, motivational video, whatever you want to call it, right? It's just me uh, when I, when I want to speak my mind. I pull out the camera and I talk, right? Whoever listens, listens. Whoever doesn't, fuck you. But um, three questions you should ask yourself, right? And I always say the three most important questions, the three most important this and that. And every time it's a new most important. So it doesn't fucking matter because things change based on your perspective, right? When you uh, uh, when you're on Earth. The moon looks fucking, you know, the sun looks tiny. When you're close to the sun, the earth looks tiny. So, no matter of perspective. So, the most important things will change based on the, the position in your life you're at the time, your situation, whatever. So, for this day and age, for this season of my life, the three most important questions I believe I, I should ask myself every morning, and I also believe a lot of you guys can ask yourself based on where in your life you are, is number one, uh, what is what, who, and when, right? Or who, what, when, who, what, when. And what I mean by that, no one or who. Who are you, right? A lot of people live their lives without even knowing who the fuck they are, right? Like, I, I, I made so many videos about this. Who are you? If I ask you right now, hey, who are you? And I, I'm not talking about your, your first name, because nowadays, names are distorted, guys. Back in the ancient days, your name meant something, right? Your parents or your community would give you a name based on what they expected of you, or based on what they saw in you, or based on what the seer or the prophet or whatever fell you would bring to the community, right? Based on the vision, so. They would look at you, uh, even if, if, if you came if out like a strong kid, they would give you a name that has strength in it, right? Or uh, if, if your father's firstborn and you give him hope or that he, his, his line will continue, he will call you like, I don't know, the, uh, the, 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 the hope of so-and-so, whatever his name is. Whatever, they give you an epic fucking name, right? Nowadays, it's Mark, you know, John, you know, uh, fucking... Um, uh, or, or Jose, whatever, like they give us random names and some of them have meaning, but most of the time we don't even know what our names fucking mean, right? We don't care, they just give us names that are sound nice, which is weird because that's not how you mention the name, name there that you But anyway, when I say who you are, I don't just mean what your name is, I don't give a fuck about your name yet until you become epic and then your name has to be remembered, which is the, the, the goal that I force upon everybody that listens to me is making your goal to have your name remembered in history. But anyway, it's a whole different video. Uh, who are you? Who are you? Ask yourself that. Seriously, if I ask you, yo, who are you? Nine out of ten people can't, can't, can't give me that answer. They'll be like, uh, uh, other than my name, uh, I, I, I don't know. That is a big problem because if you don't know your identity, how are you going to know what's expected of you? How are you going to know what you're capable of doing? So no one find out who are you before the sun sets a day. Find out who are you. If you're watching this at night before the, the sun rises tomorrow, find out who you are. Put the pieces together, right? If you don't know who you are, you won't have purpose. If you don't know your purpose, you be bored 24-7, you be depressed no matter how many games or, or how much money you have, you will have confidence to face life, you don't have confidence to talk to people or girls or whatever, and you know, because purpose is everything, and without your identity, you can't know your purpose. Number one, ask yourself, who, who are you? Number two, what are you? And I, I attribute what are you to, what do you embody? What are you the embodiment of, right? Uh, you, you know, for example, I said the grave, you tell them, what are you? You say, I'm a conqueror. If you ask uh, uh, Da Vinci, you probably say, I'm an inventor or whatever. What are you? What are you? Not what job you're doing. If you work at Walmart, I'm not asking you, do you stock groceries and shit? What are you? What ideal do you embody? Are you a, a, are you a liberator? You know, are you a, an idealist? Are you a, a revolutionary? Are you a visionary? What are you? What do you embody? Because everyone embodies something. You must embody something. What are you? Right? When you find out what are you, now the third question, you have who you are, your identity, what, you know, your heritage, whatever who you're descending of, you know. I always say that we're descendants of great kings, that that's statistically proven. Uh, number two, what are you? Number three, when? I'm sorry, where are you? Where are you? Now, why is it important to know where you are? Because if you know who you are, what you are, that means you know your purpose, you know what you have to do. Now, knowing where you are tells you what to do next, tells you what's your next step, because a lot of people don't know what they have to do next, right? They say, well, I'm stuck in my life. I'm not going anywhere. I don't know what to do next. Once you answer this first question, now you have to know where are you? Because when, let's say you know you're a conqueror, Let's say you're a descendant of a king, that's who you are. You are uh, the embodiment of, uh, I don't know, you're a conqueror, that's what you are. Number three, where are you? Because when you find out where you are, you realize that you want to conquer Asia, but you're in fucking Europe and shit. Well, you know, hey, <laughs> I, have to, you know, I have to get out of here. That's just a dumb example, but it's just good to give you. No, it's not dumb. Miguel doesn't give dumb examples. You know, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a simple example, but it's just to show you, when you know where you are, it lets you know how close you are to your goal or how far you are to your goal, which then indicates what you have to do next. It's kind of like trying to go from Texas to New York and you get lost or you, I don't know, you pass out in, your, you know, in the middle of the road or you wake up, you're like, oh fuck, where am I, right? 
Man, you want to put in a GPS? Well, how are you going to put yourself in a GPS unless you first know where you are, right? Let's say the GPS didn't have the ability to tell you where you were. You have to know where you are so you can know your destination, so you can know how far you're from your destination, right? If you wake up again in that, in that, in that simple example, you're like, oh my God, I have to go, I have to, go to New York. Uh, I don't know how much gas I need, blah, 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 blah. Once you know where you are, you will know how far you are from your destination. So you will know how much gas you have to put in your car. You will know how long you, the, the drive is going to go. Know where you are today in respective to your um, to your destination. And that will tell you what you have to do next. If you want to create, if you want to open a university, I, you know, I'm just throwing out goals out there. How far are you from that goal? Where are you now? That tells you how fast you have to move, right? How your plans have to be laid out, how much... How, how, how much harder you have to grind, you know? Design a plan for your life, fellas. So ask yourself these three questions. I'm out of here. Who you are, what you are, where you are. Tim through the offer. Check out the Wisdom channel for more videos like this and post questions out there. I'm gonna try to be a lot more active in that channel. Cause I feel like we, we you know, we, we're in a season where a lot of people are getting depressed and you know, uh, are losing their identity, right? And as, as just as well as I'm seeking my identity and my purpose and I'm actually doing it, I'm gonna stop people catch up so they don't have to go through the trial and error that I have to go through to discover my identity. All right, guys. All right, guys, what's up? Now, I know, you, I know you're looking confused, kind of like, what's this video all about? We're looking like a burnt version of the Hodge Twins right now. But anyway, <laughs> I want to tell you guys, I, I, used to, I inbox a lot of my subscribers. A lot of you guys have been with me from the beginning, and you guys message me a lot, and you know, we have conversations on Facebook, whatever. And sometimes I forget that um, I'm trying to